Right, Rory, um, home weekend at Knock Hill, ending it on the podium. Is that the uh, hardest you've had to fight to bring home some silverware in the championship? It's certainly one of the hardest races I, I have had in the BTCC. Um, I think that's what makes the championship so good, you know, it's, it is intense. And uh, I think we had some great racing there between myself, Jake and Colin and, and George. Uh, I think as a, as a weekend, we've had a, a pretty good points haul. Um, and uh, we're going to go away from a home event happy. Um, yeah. I mean, it's a, it's another example of what we discussed in the uh, in the roundup show before the weekend. If you going into a weekend, and, you know, not necessarily bringing home the win that you wanted, yes. but picking up those points towards the championship. That's exactly it. I think we just got to do what, what we can do with what we have. And um, certainly in race one, I didn't have the tools to, to kind of go forward, and I ended up losing places, unfortunately. But we we made some big setup changes. I certainly think we made steps forward and it gave me the chance to get into that, that reverse grid on the front row and, and give uh, George Gamble a bit of, bit of hassle in race three. Um, I think there's a bit, a little bit going on with straight line speed. I think it was really apparent at Knock Hill. Um, just, not just against rear wheel drive, but other front wheel drive cars with different engines. And uh, you just can't, can't put any pressure on anyone, even if you're faster through the corners, you just can't put pressure on them because they pull away in the straight. So. You know, it wouldn't take much for us to be able to be, you know, a front row car. Um, let's just see what happens in the second half of the year. I mean, you've been in the championship for a few years now, but for the circuit, which was a big weekend, 30 years of the BTCC at Knock Hill, I mean, you know, from a family perspective, how, how proud are you for the circuit to reach that mile? Yeah, it's incredible, you know. I can remember when the Super Tourers came here back in the early 90s, you know, I was only like four or five years old, and. Uh, had some amazing uh, experiences watching, um, you know, the likes of Tarquini roll his Alpha, Colin McRae turn around Matt Neal and his guest drive, and obviously John Cleland, kind of home hero, hometown hero, and obviously then the, the next generation like Gordon Sheridan and, and Matt Neal and Jason Plato in the S2000 days. But it's great to be part of the championship now as a competitor and uh, to see the circuit have, you know, it must be a bumper crowd, it must be close to a record crowd today. Uh, and yeah, just so proud of uh, everyone at the circuit.